hello, and welcome to the first edition of Arcade Assault, which is a new feature I came up with because I, A, feel like I haven't been streaming enough, and B, I want to play Super Smash Bros. more. Not that this will always deal with Super Smash Bros. So my idea for this Arcade Assault is, for some reason, I always... I always force myself to play through arcade mode in fighting games with every single character. Um, I don't know why, but I've always done it. I like seeing the endings and stuff that you get from doing arcade mode in fighting games. Uh, which is actually kind of sad because most fighting games don't really even have endings anymore. Uh, Super Smash kind of does, but like not really. I do have challenges to complete by doing it with everyone, so that's why I'm going to be doing it. Uh, so, it, yeah, as you can see here with Super Smash Bros. for Wii U, I have already beaten arcade mode, well, classic in this case, with Mario, Luigi, Peach, Bowser, Yoshi, and Rosalina. Or not, that's sort of who I have to beat it with now is Rosalina, but... It's weird, you can choose your difficulty, um... Choose four and a half, so it's not too easy. Not super hard, though. I don't know. I'm not looking for a super challenge here. I'm just looking to beat arcade mode. With every character. And in this game, there's a fucking lot of them. And this will be good because in a couple weeks, Guilty Gear will be out, so I'll have to go through arcade mode with all those characters as well. And in that, that case, I'll start right from the beginning. But I don't know, this this kind of uh, stuff, I, I end up having fun with it because I like, especially in Super Smash, like collecting the trophies and whatever that you get from doing it. Uh, but I feel like streaming it and or recording it uh, will make it much less tedious to do. So I guess it's like multifaceted. I create content, I get shit done in Super Smash or whatever game I'm playing. I have some fun. Oh, why is every battle a fucking eight player Smash, man? Really? Oh yes. No, no, Grand Ninja. Oh, Rosalina's Final Smash sucks. Easy. Too easy. Jingle. See, I don't know why I've always done this. And the arcade mode in fighting games tends to have, like, ridiculous, shitty bosses at the end that are usually wicked overpowered. You always Greninja. And Super Smash is no exception, like if I, I'm not gonna do it this time, I'll fight Master Hand and Crazy Hand as a final boss this time, which they're not that bad. But if you go to the higher difficulties, there's like this fucking... I don't even remember what it's called, Chaos something, and it's like this weird transforming blob thing that's like ridiculously strong and annoying to fight. Especially when you're trying to do some challenges in this, because if you need to beat arcade mode on, uh... I'm sorry, classic. I'm gonna keep saying arcade because that's what, what I want it to be. If you die uh, on a certain difficulty, it brings you 0.5 down. So if you're trying to do a challenge, you're basically fucked and you might need to start over. Which, eh. So yeah, I don't know, I'm thinking I'll probably do these for like an hour at a time, or depending on just how much time I have, do it for two hours or whatever, but one or two hours is probably the max, because there's, no, there's only so much I can take of grinding out arcade modes, 
especially in a game like this where there's just so fucking many characters. Especially when they're not all fun to play as. Like, I dread it when I have to play as Dini Dude. It is good practice for, like, all the characters, though. Find out what they got going on. I mean, Rosalina, I don't really have to try, because she's basically, like, the most fucking OP character in Smash at the moment. Come on, DDD. Just die. Wow, it blew it. Oh, he's doing well. Not anymore. Got a taunt. Ugh, Jet. Sonic Riders was such a wonderful game. Yeah, surprisingly, I actually liked uh, the classic mode better in the 3DS version of Smash. Uh, it it was cl it more closely resembled the way it was in old games, where like instead of just fighting a fuckload of characters like you do in this one, uh, you would go through and fight like specific characters, and then like you'd fight like metal metal characters or just like groups of characters. I mean like at the end of this you still end up fighting like a bunch of Mii's, Mii fighters that are really easy to kill but it's it's not the same. Of course Peach would be the final one. That's my boo. And one thing I definitely miss from Classic Mode in Super Smash is uh, being able to like, get weird bonuses at the end for points. You don't really get points for anything at the end of this, but, like, if you would taunt, you'd get a special bonus. Peach all day. It still bothers me that the dog from Duck Hunt's name is Duck Hunt, and it is the combination of the duck and the dog. I think that's stupid. He should be called Duck Hunt Dog. It's also so annoying to fight. Ah, oh, Lucina wasn't on my team. There was three teams. Surprise. Come on. The fighting me team. Fighting me team. Sixty coins. What a reward! Ready, go. And now, one thing I've told myself I'm not going to do is watch the credits and try to get the picture every time. Uh, in this version of Super Smash, in the 3DS version, I. Uh, you sort of like can play the credits just you could in every other Super Smash. It's kind of like a weird mini game. In this, it is you have to try to hit the credits in order to like fill out a picture, which I was trying to do get 100% in every one, but it takes way too long and the pictures are not fucking worth it to waste my life for that long. So usually what I do is I'll jump up a couple times to hit it to get a general sense of the picture and then just fucking give up because all it gets you is like a hundred coins. It's stupid. Crazy hand. Crazy hand. It's crazy. 
like that. Solid fist bump. And like, as far as arcade mode final bosses go, Master Hand is easy. And then like, the next step up is Crazy Hand. And like, that's that's not even that bad. Like, it's not just like, outright bullshit. Like, the Guilty Gear demo, I know it, j it just came out in America, uh, but I had played the Japanese version months ago. The final boss in that is Ram Lethal, and the only arcade mode in the demo is the easiest difficulty, and Ram Lethal can still, like, just fucking annihilate you in, like, one second, if she feels like it. So I'm sure in the future of this wonderful series, uh, you'll get to see me retry the boss numerous, numerous times with characters that I am not good with. Because, I mean, that's always the case. There's always characters you're going to be better with than others, so... Usually that's why I don't do things like play with the character I main first or characters I'm good with first. I just go in the order that they are on the screen. I used, I used to do the ones I liked first, and then you realize, like, afterwards, like, oh shit, now literally all I have left is characters that I hate being or am not good with, and that's not a good look. Final results. Yeah, six custom parts. Classic, and this is also a good way to unlock items and trophies. Look at that rose in the trophy. So majestic. And yeah, I have Toon Link because I did multiplayer classic with my brother. And it unlocked none of the like ending videos and stuff for Toon Link. So it was like a waste of my life. And now I gotta fucking beat it with Toon Link on my own. I was hoping that I could just do it twice as quick with Willy and save me some time, but... Surprise, I still gotta fucking do it. Alright, we got the basic gist. Two colored Rosalinas hugging. Sure. Yep, that is literally all it is. Actually, let's, let's get the fire, fire bomb. There we go. Each character is like a tiny, like, 10 second ending video. Usually they're pretty enjoyable, they're just like dumb shit that the developers made the characters do. Oh, 88%, not even trying. Impressive. It never lets me push start there. It's infuriating. That was the worst ending video yet. Impressive. Oh boy, Bowser Jr. Bowser Jr. Tell you one thing right now, I am not good with Bowser Jr. So we're gonna we're gonna go to four, not four point five. Let's go right for the rival. Let's get right in there. Oh, I shouldn't have just been regular Bowser Jr. I should have been like one of the Koopa kids. Mort. Iggy. Wendy. Oh yeah. We know we're gonna kick ass when Sonic Heroes is playing in the background. So like I I like Bowser Jr. I just I would never be able to play as him. He's more of like a, a troll character, I guess. He's just a really good character for like trolling the shit out of everybody. Oh god.
he's really strong though, so like I, I don't get it. Like he's got a bunch of bullshit projectiles and stuff, and like his up beam, he jumps out of his cart and makes it explode. Oh, zero trophy. Yes. And he can just like chuck Koopa bombs and shit, and it's really annoying for everybody you're fighting. I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I'm. I don't know if it's good to fight one on one or fight like a hundred of them at once. I, I haven't done enough experimenting to see if it's a certain amount of fights you have to do total or how many characters you kill. We will test that as we have many characters to test that theory with. Oh, jeez. No, come on. Really? Shoot a cannonball? Wow, that actually hit her? Holy shit. Oh, it's Starfy. Great. I forget that they're also not the Omega versions of these stages, so they actually all have stage hazards. So there will probably be a couple occasions where I just die. Because I'm not paying attention. As I probably would have on this stage. There we go, right at the tip. Swing that hammer. Okay, I guess it is just a certain amount of fights. Zelda. He really will go through and say every character's name if you let him, which I think is crazy talk. See, the, what I don't understand about these battles is how many, how many we got? One, two, three, four. Okay, it is an actual full-fledged eight-player battle here. But these, usually they happen on stages that you can't pick if you're playing eight-player Smash multiplayer. Which I wish you could, because most of the fucking stages for eight-player Smash are, like, huge. And you can't fucking see your character at all. Wow, that was easy. Fuck. Custom moves from Marth, sure. Ready, go. Customization over here. Team battle. Oh, Meta Knight this time. Our homeboy Meta Knight. Oh, nice. Swimsuit Shulk. Getting in on the battle. So, so, like, I, I liked Xenoblade. It was, like, one of the best RPGs on the Wii, which I guess, like, when I say that out loud, doesn't really mean anything, because, like, what really was there? I mean, there were definitely, like, hidden gems on the Wii. Like, I'm not, I'm not trying to degrade it or anything. Like, it had a lot of good games, but... I mean, Xenoblade was, like, one of the only Wii... RPGs and like it was good, but like I don't get why people really wanted Shulk in this game. But, like when I, it's just one of those things where like when I think about Super Smash Brothers, I think about like Nintendo characters, and like Shulk just isn't a Nintendo character. Which like Mega Man definitely is. I associate Mega Man with the Nintendo and Super Nintendo. I I don't associate Pac Man in any way with Nintendo products. And just like I didn't associate Snake in any way with Nintendo products because he was a fucking one of the mainstays of PlayStation for a long time. They only had one Metal Gear Solid game on a fucking Nintendo console. Well, that's not I guess Metal Gear 
one and two, and then like the weird GBA ports and Game Boy ports and shit like that. But Twin Snakes on GameCube was really the only true like Metal Gear Solid Snake game. Well, I guess Metal Gear uh, 3 came to the 3DS at some point, right? Probably. This is still, even so, I, f I just I feel like Shulk doesn't really fit in. And he, he looks weird on top of that. I don't like it. I guess it's cool he's in here, though, you know? Give the fans what they want. But if they were doing that, they would have put Gino in this game for me. Show me that Super Mario RPG love. Ooh. What is up, Danger Killer 80? Jesus. Fighting me, team. Wow. Bowser Jr. is good for that shit. Crazy hand. <laughs> Say, so, yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking with this series, since I have so many fucking characters, or th this game, since I have so many characters, I'll stream this, but when I do Guilty Gear, I'll probably just record it and put up individual episodes. This will be a much shorter time. Whereas I feel like if I play this for the rest of my life, I'll never be classic with every character. God damn it, I hate those fucking cards. Oh I'm gonna go poorly. What if I die? That will be embarrassing. Oh boy, that might actually happen. Fuck. Alright. Come on, crazy. One. Boom! That was not my- that was not a good Bowser Jr. display. It's okay, we're not here to be good, we're here to be classic mode. Final results. What? Well, I guess I did get the zero trophy. It's a good trophy. Bowser Jr. Am I out of the Mario characters finally? Oh no, I gotta fucking be Wario now, don't I? Remember, just do enough to see what the general gist of the picture is. Then just skip it, because I don't want to waste time. Really? It's him just in his cart? Shit's lame.
I like that one. That that last picture, that's solid. All eight Koopa kids. Ooh, got a challenge. Ugh. God, I hate Wario. Not as a character, just like... Playing him in this game. Same thing, we're gonna do four again, because my Wario play is low. Sure, fight rival Zelda. I feel, I feel like I gotta say this somewhere. Everywhere I go, I fucking see people who want Waluigi in this game. And, like, I, I cannot grasp it. I don't get why the fuck anyone wants Waluigi in this game, let alone why anyone likes Waluigi as a character. He's not a good character. He's terrible. Yes, I realize Wario is evil Mario, and Waluigi is evil Luigi. But, like... Come on. He's never been in his own game. He only shows up for the bullshit party exclusives. Like, the first game he's fucking in is Mario Tennis on the N64. And the first thing he says is in the intro sequence, he draws eyes on a poster of Luigi and says, Take that, Mr. Eyeballs. What a shitty thing to say. What a shitty character. I, if I keep talking about it, I'm getting angry. Fuck Waluigi. It's, that's all I got. He should not be in this game. H him being an assist trophy, I feel like, is too much. And he's too fucking good as an assist trophy, even. Getting angry. Oh shit, I forgot. These are the real versions of the stages. Gotta watch out. The fuck version of Ashley's song was that? Intruded. I don't even know what that means. Oh, Metal Luigi. Even worse. You can't trick me, Villager. I'm not standing by your tree. No, no. Oh, fuck that, Luigi. Stay away from me. You metal ass. You want metal too now? What you do? Stay metal forever. Come on, bring it. Bring it, bring it. Yeah, boy. This is, it, it, it freaks me out that this has been 
in each game since Melee, this stage on it, from Earthbound. And this is the first game where the song on it is a song in the game. And you know, I'm a huge fan of the song, so I'm really glad it's in here, but I think it's, it's fucking ludicrous that this was the first one where the song that takes place in this area is was in, in it. I, I don't know. Holy shit, am I gonna die again? Come on, Captain Falcon. As we check game watch. Red Ribbon. Always my boo. Chic. Ready? Go! Man, she is so good. It's out of control how good she is. I gotta stop whistling. There's just enough delay on OBS that it's probably infuriating. Yeah, eat motorcycle. Shake that ass. Really? They all got back on? No. I still haven't gone to look at all the trophies I've gotten. I, I don't know, I'm saving it for some special occasion, I guess, where I just go and revel in all the Nintendo nostalgia and other other franchises, other companies. Boy, I cannot get back. Jesus Christ. I'm not a fan of Wario's recovery. There is a pretty high chance I'm going to die here. Careful. Oh yeah. Wow, that was close. I definitely probably should have died there. Whatever.
I I really like WarioWare. I was never a fan of that WarioWare costume. I feel like these pictures are getting more lame and lame each time. Unless there's something magical down here. And the answer is no, there's not. How nice Wario can crawl. Look at that back pedal. That butt shimmy. Alright, last one for last one for tonight. I think four characters is solid for for our first time. Be pink DK. We'll go four and a half. Even though DK seems to be like a low tier in this, I have I have faith that I can do okay with him. Claps. See how D I think DK's awesome. I don't I don't care what anyone says. DK's alright. Sure I died, but it was because of uh stupid assist trophy. I don't even know what that's from. I gotta look that up. The weird little girl who like beats the shit out of you with a frog or whatever. I'll do this one. We can get the zero cents on us. Yoshi. It's Tear Horror. Oh, and, P and Pikachu? Alright. And someone else? Pit. Peach. Zero Suit Samus. It's really funny since I, since I mean Peach, every time Peach is on one of the stages, I think I'm her for a second. Uh, I can't charge my punch in this eight player battle. Was I thinking, oh my god, am I gonna die in every level? Jesus Christ. Alright, there we go. Oh, and then I wasted it. Jesus, Luigi. Lamb. Ho ho trophy. Oh 
got him with the clap. Charging up the punches. Oh, I missed barely. Use a Pokeball. In case you couldn't tell, not a fan of A Player Smash. I mean, sure, maybe under the right conditions with a bunch of friends, but it's C CPUs, it's stupid. Super armor? Damn. I don't like Rob as a character also. I don't know if I've mentioned that yet. That's true, no one else is here. Gotta test out Ganondorf's custom moves. Ooh, donkey on Diddy action. And then he just killed himself for me. Easy. That says our trophy. Getting a lot more custom moves than normal. multi-hit moves for that. Oh, come on, really? Right into it? I think that's my least favorite attack they do together. Oh, 
shit. Let's see, it tells us to use your Donkey Kong. Ooh, ah. Easy. We're getting there. We're getting there. It's gonna be a long road. We're gonna have to have many more, many more sessions of this before Classic with every character is cleared. Yeah, so out of the four we did today, it seems like it'll be the best picture. Yeah, yeah, this is a solid one. Let's see if there's anyone in this corner. I'm guessing no. Yeah, nah. Now that I'm skipping all these, I'm sure there'll be a challenge for getting 100% on all of them, but I no longer care. Alright. <laughs> we did four characters today. Uh, many, many more to go. Uh, but it has been fun. I will probably be back tomorrow to do at least four more. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.